What's going on guys? It is the Phantom Michael and I just wanted to come to you guys today and just talk to you guys about the mega evolution theories that are going around for Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go Eevee. I mean, it's 100% confirmed. We've seen that Nintendo took out some new copyrights for um, some individual Pokemon from Kanto and I just wanted to share with you some Pokemon that I want to see get mega evolutions. Um, I believe videos like this have been made before, but I just want to tell you guys what I think. So yeah, all right, sit back, enjoy, just listen to it. Um, so I think one of the Pokemon that come to mind for Kanto that I really wish had just something crazy about it would be Lapras for me. Um, a Mega Lapras would be awesome. Um, it's really fun to use in the game. It's one of your like really close companions as far as like a ride Pokemon for Surf early on. Um, I mean, whenever I got Lapras after in Silco, that was just that was great, man. That was so much fun. Um, I usually always keep a Lapras because I always pick Charizard. Let's be honest. Um, but yeah. A mega Lapras would be absolutely insane. Let's go. Um, I know there's been a lot of talk about a mega Starmie, um, but for me, I love Starmie, man. Um, my OU competitive team, I usually use a Starmie, so a mega Starmie would be freaking awesome. Um, I don't, I'm gonna try to look for some cool designs and try to pick out which one of my favorite. You probably see it on the screen right now, so yeah. Um, but just what could you do with a mega Starmie? Like, what? what could go on in your head like your creativity like how would this thing look that would be pretty intense for me so yeah starmie is definitely up there um the next pokemon to talk about would probably be jinx um we know there's a huge controversy with jinx um and i feel like maybe a mega evolution or just something for jinx would you know maybe shed some better light on it because what jinx and porygon got a lot of a lot of diss in the original anime but i feel like if you know you got Jinx and you gave it a mega evolution and just change it up a bit. I feel like it would be more like more accepted. I feel like you could say. So, yeah, I think a mega Jinx would be pretty awesome. Um, next up, a mega Weezing. Yo, I love me some Weezing. Uh, UU tier, I believe, was the last time I've used a Weezing. Um, a mega Weezing, though, that would be interesting. What could you do for a mega Weezing? I'm going to try to find a picture or something. But what could this thing even do, man? Just like a, a nice little boost to its special attack, I think. And some, uh, maybe some defenses going. I don't know, man. Dude, Mega Weezing would be freaking intense. Um, the next Pokemon, uh, Mega Tentacruel. A Mega Tentacruel. Now, I know some people don't really like Tentacruel. But I think Tentacruel has an awesome design. And I feel like a Mega Tentacruel, like a giant Kraken type pokemon would be really awesome um in the anime we had the giant crack the giant tentacle that destroyed that city i feel like just something like that just to make it like so much more of a monstrosity would be really really cool um the next pokemon uh nitto queen and nitto king if they had megas yo yo i love i love the nitto king nitto queen line i really do i love both their shinies um but I feel like having Megas of each one would be really intense. And I like how you can make them both special attackers too. They can be physicals or specials. I just feel like there's so much you could do with a Mega Nidoking King and a Mega Nidoking Queen that I feel like they, they need it, man. They definitely need it. Um, the next Pokemon, uh, Mega Fero. I think Fero is one, one of the cool bird type Pokemon. You know how like every single gen has like, you know, your regular early on starter bird type pokemon kanto had uh pidgey and had spiro but i feel like and we got mega pidgeot so i feel like a mega spiro would be justified and i think a mega spiro would be really really cool just think about that like just an awesome fly i don't know it's a it's a really hard hitting visit i learned this um i did a a fire red nuzlocke like not randomized nothing just a regular nuzlocke and i caught a spiro let me tell you what spiro hits like a tank man it just goes through it is it is awesome i really i really like spiro and Firo now because of that little playthrough that i did but yeah i think a mega Firo would be pretty awesome um let's talk about far-fetched a mega far-fetched or just an evolution of far-fetched would be justified i think i feel like it should be a fighting normal type or something along those lines but um far-fetched though a mega far-fetched i don't really I don't really know how I feel about that, but definitely an evolution for Farfetch'd. Um, it's on this list because either or would be cool. 
Um, but I'd be leaning more towards Evolution than Mega, in my opinion. But yeah. Um, the next one, Mega Venomoth. Duh. Um, Mega Venomoth would be really intense. Poison Bug type, I feel like you could do so much work with that. Um, change it up a little bit. I feel like, you know, maybe Poison Psychic or something like that. Um, poison Psychic. Bug Psychic. I don't know. Something like that, because I feel like, no, it's definitely more of a poison than I think a psychic. Poison flying, maybe? I'm not sure. Something along those lines. But a Mega Venomoth would be really cool, really justified, I think. I feel like they need a lot more bug-type Mega Evolutions. But yeah, but and that's going to bring me to my last one that I believe is on this list, and that's Mega Butterfree. Mega Butterfree needs to happen. We got Vega, Mega Beedrill, so I feel like we need to have a Mega Butterfree, in my opinion. Um, kind of like a balance kind of guy, like a yin type of yang. I feel like a mega butterfree would be really cool, but I definitely want it to be psychic bug instead of bug flying because I feel like butterfree is way more on the psychic side than on the, you know, the flying bug, you know, it's a bug type obviously, but instead of bug flying, I think it should just be bug psychic, maybe with compound eyes or something. So it could like really hit those really crucial moves. Um, so yeah. That's my list, guys, for what I want to see for Mega Evolutions and Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go Eve, or even Gen 8, either or. Regardless, I'm going to play the game. You guys are going to see me watch it. So, yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment down below, let me know. And with that, I've been the Phantom Michael. I'm going to get the heck out of here. I'll see you guys in the next one.